Hello everybody, it's Mindy and I know that's a lot of stuff, right? So this is from Fan Cells and let me tell you what happened. Um, I, I was asked to place another order, you know, I do that about once a month and I did that and then my contact came back and was like, hey, we just got these new things and um, I would wonder if you wanted to show some of those. And I said, sure, because I love them. And so then he was just like, okay, let me just, I can only do so much because, you know, they have budgets that they can give everybody and whatnot. And I said, okay, then I'll pick these two. And he's like, okay. But then he ended up, he just sent me a whole bunch of stuff. Anyhow, there's a bunch of stuff here. Okay. So I'm just going to pick, I think I'm going to do like this stuff here first. And then, I mean, I got like one, I don't know, a bunch of paintings here too. So I'm going to kind of split this up, I think, and just throw a few in there like that. And I'll save all of these for like later. Do you hear my dog? She's trying to choke over here. I might have to go make sure she's okay. <laughs> what is your deal? <laughs> Are you all right? Okay, I think she's okay. All right, so this is one of the things that they'd started carrying that I really, really was interested in. You've probably seen a couple people show these, but I thought I wanted to, I wanted to get some, and I might buy some more because um, I think they'll be awesome. My thought was, well, let me show you what it is first. For like some of the larger projects, that these would be cool to use to store up some of the larger projects in. Okay, let's show you. Alrighty, let's get you out of there. And don't forget this right here. Okay, so this is a little funnel you can use to, um, let's see, do I wanna open it? I'm not gonna open it. It's a funnel you can use to help put your drills into containers. All right, that's what it is. Collapses down, stays nice and small. Look, I have a yellow drill on my counter from yesterday. Something I unboxed yesterday had yellow ABs that were just floating around and the painting didn't even have yellow ABs. All right, so this is how these work. These are drawer systems, okay? And inside the drawers are these bottles, which I just thought this would be perfect. If you wanted to kit up a larger project, let's see, how many does each drawer hold? Let's find that out first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 22, that's an odd number. I got 22 though. All right, so you can get 22 colors in there and you add another drawer, you got 44. Look, these are neat and compact. Um, it's a nice sturdy plastic and you can actually attach these to a wall if you would like, you know, put some nails and you could attach them. You can stack them this way. They just slide together or you can attach them side by side. Let's see if I can do this here real quick. Um, so they could go next to each other. Can I do it? Can I do it? Okay, you gotta do it a certain way. You gotta do it from this end. Come on. Okay, maybe maybe I can't do it. Eh, come on. Seems to be, okay, really? Just watch me struggle, right? Watch me struggle. It seems to be in there. There we go. Okay, so. You can hook them next to each other like this. You can put more on top. You get this is a good concept, right? How this can grow. You can get as wide as you want, tall. You can make a nice, you know, rack. I like four of these. If I had four of these, I could kit up some of my largest paintings and look at how compact that would be, right? It would only take up that much space and you can just go higher if you'd like. I thought these were just a superb idea little hole here, a little handle to pull it. The bottles are a nice size. I love the size of the bottles with the screw top. Yes, I'm going to get some more of these. <laughs> um, if I had a couple more sets, maybe even one more set, maybe two, I have six of them. I could kit up a hundred and some colors easy, no problem, and just leave it in here. Nice, right? 
and how easy would it be to get in there and find your drills? I love this. You could also use it for long-term storage. If you wanted to store drills away in this, it would work for that as well. Um, you could put little labels on the front, like this is DMC numbers, you know, whatever to whatever is in this drawer, you know, multi-purpose. If you don't want the bottles, you can order these without bottles and just the drawers. And you can use them for whatever you'd like to put in the drawers. I believe you can also get them with the Tic Tac containers if you like those versus the bottles. Very versatile storage solution. I loved it. So I got that. I will be getting more. <laughs> I will be getting more. All right. Let's look at the one painting that I pulled out for this part of the video. Let's see what we got. Got scissors today. I've been cutting things with my scissors. <laughs> All right. There's some uh, hefty duty ones in that other pile. Some, you know, fatter ones. I wonder what I got. You know, it's always a surprise when stuff comes. I mean, you know what you ordered, but you forget, you know. And then it gets here and you're like, oh yeah, oh yeah, I remember now. <laughs> All right. I like this canvas. It's, it's um, fairly firm, but it's not super firm. All right. Oh, 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 oh. Look at I'll be known for Christmas. <laughs> you know what that's going to be, right? Oh my. It's, oh, I love this size. Would you like a pull tab? <laughs> what is a Mindy video without a pull tab once in a while? I seem to get them often. Maybe other people do too and they just don't show them. Okay, so we got some major creases here. This has been creased up and folded up for a while. Here's our tool kit, but we'll work on that. And look at them. Aren't they cute? 23 colors. There's a legend on both sides. Has the DMC codes on both sides. This is called a 35 by 50. Let's see what it is. I like the size. I really do. It's bigger. I, I like it. Okay, what do, we, what do we really have here? We have 30. Okay, so it's going to be 30 by 45. That is a perfect size. I love that. Love it. You can read the lettering. I'll be gnome. I did that already. Sorry. <laughs> uh, look at the little gnome in the truck. Okay, he's got a plaid truck. I mean, seriously, how can you not love that? It's a plaid truck. <laughs> and he's got antlers on his hat. These guys down here have their gifts. He's all tangled up in the lights. Aren't Okay, really? Come on. How can you not love this? It, it's adorable. Oh my goodness. Got a lot of white background. Oh, wait. Wait. No, no, no. Oh, it is not one color. No, it's not. Look at that drill field. Sure, camera. I said look at the drill field. Camera. Camera. Hello. Thank you. It's not one color. It's J's and I's. J's and I's. Maybe more J's and I's, but mm. yep. It's picture printed. Clear. Those G's and E's, uh, you know, okay. They're not bad. They're not bad. We can see those. See the G's and the E's in there? A plaid truck. Really? With a bunch of gnomes. I'm just in love. <laughs> All right. Let's look at the drills because these are these are interesting. There's some colors in here. Let's figure out what the background is. I and J. Well, the I is 3865, so the I is white, but the J? Hmm. J is 819. Okay, these have your DMC codes on the bags. All right, can you see that? 3865. It's right there. Come on. There we go. It's 23 on the canvas. There you go. I like that. All right. Um, what is our number I'm looking for? 10. When we get to number 10, that's our background. All right. So purple. There's some purple in there. I don't know where the purple's at, but there's purple. Some rust. Oh, look at that. 
The background is pink. Oh, I love it. The background's pink and white. Ah, uh, okay. I, I really like this kit. I really, really like it. <laughs> oh, I want this one done for Christmas. Look, at, there's some more pinks and some more pinks. I didn't think there would be that much pink in it, but there really is. Okay, I want to see it again. Look at it. Look at it. Aren't they cute? Oh my gosh, they turn out, that's going to turn out so good. I love it. Love that. Okay. I did a good job with that one, huh? <laughs> it wasn't me. I just, I just liked the picture. I didn't know it was going to be that good. <laughs> it's really that good. <laughs> okay. What else do we have over here? Let's get into this bag. Oh, this is what I opened to figure out who this was. Okay. So what is in here? Here's a tool kit in here. Oh, and our chain. This is going to be a hanging type decoration. I'm really into these hanging decorations because I think they'll be so much fun. You can put them all over your house. And I needed one for spring. Look at that one. Look at it. It's a basket of roses. It's so pretty. Now, I like this. Okay, this is that white plastic. Um, but what I like about this is look at the background. We got yellow down here peach and then it turns pink and almost white up here so the whole background of this is colored i love that it's gonna have rhinestones and some special drills i see some a's and some b's the rest looks like rhinestones but let's see what we have these are so much fun to do they're not that hard they don't take that long they're pretty pretty quick and they're just so pretty when they're done and this one is rhinestones. Rhinestone cowboy. <laughs> uh, yeah, yep, it's a singing day. Okay, it's a singing kind of day. Look at those numbers. Can you tell what they are? Number one, green. Clear. Orangey color. I don't know what that is. Pink. A pink. Told you, it's a lot of rhinestones. A yellow. Another pink. Another pink. And here's our special things. An iridescent purple teardrop. Oh, and a green glob. Did you see that just drop in there like that? He said, wait, wait. <laughs> it's not just purple teardrops. A red teardrop, iridescent, and some gold balls. Where do the gold all the gold balls will be the centers? Perfect. Perfect. Love it. Okay. I'm enjoying this unboxing. How about you? I'm having a good time. I'm having a good time. This is cute too. You can already tell what it is, but this is a little different than your average hanging ornament because, ooh, look, we get some sticky stuff, mounting squares. Mmm, boy, I used to have a whole bunch of those because if you ever tried to stick stuff to a classroom wall that's made out of blocks, you know, and then paint, yeah, you got to come up with all kinds of creative ways to get things to stick to the wall love this oh my love that mm -mm -mm. how pretty the birds man did i get this already i don't know <laughs> i might have i don't care <laughs> it's so pretty i could do it twice and this has a whole little light pack and this is like little led lights that you'll string around the back of this and there's little holes you can put your lights through can i see the little hole right there a hole right there okay and this is where your chain will go up here but it lights up it's so pretty and this is just a separate piece this is just a separate little thing it has its own little chain here somewhere yeah it's floating around in the box it has its own little chain you make a little keychain out of it all right love it uh, this is looking familiar like i might have got that one already I'm going to have to, this is what I'm going to do. <laughs> I just thought of this today. I'm going to make a picture folder. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make a picture folder in my photos where I put a picture of the things I've ordered. If they're similar, like for the gnomes, because I'm ordering a lot of gnomes, some of these hanging things, some of the things I get a lot of the same, I'm going to put them in a picture folder. I remember because it's hard to go back and look at. I look a little dusty in that bag. 
hard to go back to all the separate emails to find out what I ordered. Ooh, bunch of those. Those are pretty. Smooth blue marquees. Those are gorgeous. And then some teardrops. We have two bags of those as well. The iridescent clear. Yeah, just to, you know, make my life easier, be able to figure out what I've ordered. Um, I'm narrowing down my companies that I'm going to work with on a regular basis. But, yep, I already turned down one today. <laughs> uh, had somebody wanting to want me to try clothing. I'm like, clothing? Um, okay. I don't know. We'll see. I'll go back and look at that one. <laughs> Toolkit again. Our drills. Here is our twine to hang this with. I have looked at this one several times. Now, I don't understand how this happens, <laughs> but how do they get like these burn marks on the back? It doesn't show, well, it doesn't show through to the front, but anyhow, this comes out. Yeah, yeah. I've looked at this one for a while and hadn't gotten it yet. Um, I really wish I would have had this one for our retreat because it was all like coastal stuff. <laughs> it would have been fun, but I love this one. It's got some sailboats, the, the rope. A life preserver. I love this one. Mm, yes. And so you just hang it right through that little hole with your twine, apparently, because there's no other holes on it. You just loop it through there and do -do 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 -do, it's going <laughs> to hang out. <laughs> All right. Let's look at the drills. And then that'll be it for this part of the unboxing. I'd like to say thank you so much for sending me all of these wonderful things. This is a company, this is one I keep. FG Normal, I keep in my alignment, in my alignment, in my lineup. Okay, I just used these on a painting last night. They are not clear. They are iridescent. They look clear, but they are iridescent and they are super pretty. Um, I only had a few in the, in the object I did last night. It wasn't a painting, it was some off canvas thing I did. These are gorgeous. So pretty. I have some champagne colors. Oh, look at this. It's a light, light blue with a hint of purple. Super pretty. Oh, we get some white ABs. Love that. And of course, blues and reds. Those are pretty smooth reds. Purple? Okay, snowflakes, stars, whatever you call those. And look at those white, white globey things, pearls, white pearls, nice. All right, I love these. They are fun. This would be something to hang up in the summer. Wouldn't it be great if you had like a cottage or something? You could hang that in your cottage, all beachy like, you know? Love it. All right, I, I adore this unboxing. I, I do. I love it. Look, we thought we were going to see this. Remember? I said, oh, you've already seen it. Well, it wasn't that at all. <laughs> it was not that one at all. <laughs> it was the birdhouse. And I love the birdhouse. I'm just thinking I've already unboxed the birdhouse, but I don't remember. Oh, what's happening to my memory? I don't know. Anyhow, thank you so much for watching this. I love showing you the fun stuff. And then we had a cool painting. I love that painting. I really do. Pink and white background? Mm, okay, I really want to do one of the full drill gnomes. I've been doing the special drill gnomes, but I really want to do a full drill one. You know, maybe he'd be something I could work on in November because I don't have anything in November. No events I'm doing Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go now. I know, singing, goofiness, you know, whatever. Okay, I'll talk to everybody soon. I hope you enjoyed. I'll link everything below so you can go look at it and see if you're interested. These storage containers, mm, love them. Love, love, and love. Okay? Love those. All right. I will talk to everybody soon. Hit that like button. Uh, if you're new here and you liked what you saw, subscribe. Come back. See more stuff. Okay? All right. I will talk to everybody soon. Have a great day. Bye, everybody.